Hey, what's going on, guys and girls? <coughs> Hard Drive 163, you know, the Mud Duck Station by the Rio Grande. How's everybody doing? Good. This video, uh, I think I got a way of showing some stuff. And uh, this pretty much covers all radios. This one, the 955, is going to be like the, le the least extreme. Because they're already pretty decent out of the box. First off, I'm going to cover this again. Alright. Fresh. Very fresh. Got the point. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show, which is first one right here, I'm going to show three radios. This one, right out of the box, only converted mode selector flip to AM, channel selector to channel 20, noise blanker off, RF gain wide open, clarifier straight up and down, which it's on it's it's factory set anyways. Then I'm gonna show one that's tuned. Then I'm gonna show mine with a 2SC 2999. You guys hear me say, you know, further, clearer, less white noise. Well, it ain't easy to show, but I think I got away this time. It's been a long couple of days, so bear with me, alright? It's like I got, I'm getting all these radios done, so, here, well, let's give this a try. What you're viewing on the scope right now is the, the voltage. See my hand on the volume? extremely critical that this is set correctly to make these measurements. The top part might look a little bit off because of the angle of the camera. All right, there we go. I'm set at 60, uh, 67 dB down which is 100 microvolt or S9. That's where you set the S9 on all these 10 meter radios. <clears throat> so I feel like I'm losing my voice. Hopefully you can hear me. So we're going to go through each of these radios, and at the end I'm going to try to, if I remember, I'm going to show you 135 dB down. Maybe it'll make some sense. I was going to write all this stuff down and try to show it, you know. I've dry run this video a couple of times, but I think I got it. Hope it shows you something. I hope you'll get something out of it. Some of you text, some of the numbers are going to be different. You know, there's commercial, there's military, there's CB, there's ham. Well, let's just go straight by this. Fresh. All right. So now you know where we're set. You see all the levels. Here, let me zoom in a little bit. Okay. I'll zoom back out. Zoom. Make sure we can see everything. And oh yeah, make sure that you can see everything. If someone ever has a radio out of your sight or they don't show you everything at the same time, man, I'm telling you. <laughs> hocus pocus going on. Alright. New out of the box, 67. DB down S9. Cyan's reading 36. You see the AC level. 30% modulation like you've seen. Alright, so now we're going to drop this radio down. Oh, let's take a look at distortion. 1.6. Alright, let's go back to Cyan. And it's, it's reading on sign at 35, 36. Okay, now we're going to drop it down. We're down to 107 and 15. 111. There's 12. And we're like about 112 dB down for 10. And it's going back and forth, 113, 112. Okay at 112 
our distortion is like 27. Go back to sign ed. Now let's drop this down. It's 130. When you hear it beep, that's 137. I gotta go one click up and back down again. It's 137. Okay, now over here. So to keep everything on the scale for this video, I have to turn on like a uh, an attenuator. Channel one and two have volts per division right here, but I have this button. It's 0.5 or one volt. I have it turned on so that I can get it all on the scale, but now I'm going to turn it off so now you can actually read it. Alright? And what I'm going to do is oh, wait a minute, make sure nothing else in the way. Yep, see I already did it once. So let's go like this. Delete. There's Mofo. Delete, can't delete Mofo, delete. And camera, in the same distance, same everything. Okay, that's uh, like front end noise, just noise, noise in the receiver itself. That's that one. Next one, get this out of the way safely. This tune, I didn't do the transmit yet. It's aligned on frequency and the receiver's been aligned. The AF update. We're gonna start this little procedure all over again. So let's go back to 67. You know, I forgot to. No, I didn't. Okay, 67. Thirty percent AM modulation. And we're already thirty nine sign ad. Distortion one point two, one point one. Back to sign ad. There's sixty seven. Click it, let me see it. All right. Everything's set. All right, so let's drop it down. One thirteen. Click the little button so it ain't so bright and you can see it. All right. So uh, let's see. At one thirteen. Our distortion is going to be, what is that, 28? Got sign it. Now let's drop this one all the way down. We're going to one extreme to another. I'm not sure if the camera's going to pick that up or not. Actually, my camera picks this stuff up fine, even when I upload these videos. 
onto my computer. It's YouTube that has a hard time seeing this. And I upload them at 10, 1080. And it pisses me off. Anyways, alright, so now we want to take a closer look at the noise. Alright. that one. Shut this one off. Now, as you can see, no hocus pocus. For S9, turn that back down. Get the bolt set. Either way, you can see the bolts right there. Sign add 40, 41. Distortion 0.9. And let's see. This is what the 2SC2999, like I said. Some people will argue. <laughs> That's what they do, I guess. Hold on. Make that sunny so bright. Okay. Okay, let's drop. This one down now. Oh, did I get distortion? Sign it. And let's go down to 137. Oh, just make that so it ain't so bright. So usually, you just end up with a bunch of noise, right? We don't want no stinking noise. Okay, now let's turn this off. one. There's Mofo. He's a good boy. He really is. The best things in life are free. Okay. That's out of the box. That's tuned. And that's with a 2SC2999. You can watch the video again if you like. And like I said, I'd show you, or let you notice 135 dB down. This is with the headphones on, and this is, I just use junk like this. You know, this type of thing. I could plug my external speaker into it. 
these are like five bucks and with the headphones on you okay, know by the way that's noise blanker noise blanker off you can barely see anything I'm going to change this a little bit let me go back to here let me zoom me in a little bit well let me get it in there first see you don't talk to nobody at 30 percent modulation you know if you do <laughs> there's something something up now this is my radio talking to one of my radios and we see my radios receiving each other's radios right there at 100 percent modulation you know that that frequency curve they're going to get out they're going to hear each other and let's see let's go up to 100 percent modulation no one talks really at 30 like I just said but there is 100 alright got it all and the best way I can show you how it hears is I'll let me try to show you there's the radio it's all right there There's the volume. You know everything's set. I'm just changing the channel. I don't know if you can hear that. You can see it though. With headphones on, I'm just changing the channel. Yeah. At 135 dB down. And I'll tell you what. It's not often, I don't know if it's once a year even that, when I hear over the airwaves, hard drive, you know, it's the first time I ever talked to you or anybody on 28 or 19 or whatever channel we're on in DX land. I was like, yeah, ain't that shit cool. Yeah, I got the headphones on, I got some decent equipment here good coax halfway decent antenna and right now I don't have a lot of noise in my receiver you know, I'm surrounded by power lines and 50 year old transformers but I was reluctant to show this I did show it anyways the 2SC 2999 and by the way youngster over there in Alabama yeah man I know you talk shit sometimes that's okay but there you go it, it does make a difference. Less noise, hear further, you know. But if you don't have all the right equipment, this is a waste of your money to do this. The tune alone will do a lot, but if you figure out the algebraic equation of gain and loss elevation of the antenna and the loss in your coax for using some RG8 or something, you're never going to hear this. The loss is greater than the gain. I hope some of this was interesting. I hope you guys got something out of it. Hope everybody has a wonderful Christmas and a prosperous new year. It's hard drive. 163 down by the Rio Grande. Y'all be good. Later.